I'm going to be making a palm and ginger martini. For this, we're going to use some vodka, some ginger, lemon juice, palm syrup, pressed apple juice, and some palm. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to start by chilling down my martini glass. This is very important because every element needs to be as cold as possible before we actually serve the drink. First thing I'm actually going to be mixing up, cut up my ginger and then to muddle it with the five mils of palm syrup. So I'm going to muddle it all together using this. This just presses all out and gets all the juices out of the inside of the actual ginger. Now we do this with the syrup because it's quite hard to muddle up the ginger, quite dry by itself. Next up, I'm going to add 50 mils of vodka. And then I'm going to add 10 mils of lemon juice. When you're making any cocktails, really, you want to have half as much of the sweetness in and the sour. If you don't have a measuring glass, you can just use a normal shot glass, which is what we're using here today. It holds about 25 mils of liquid. Next, I'm going to add 12 and a half, which is half a shot of pressed apple juice. And then last, we're going to add 25 mils of one shot of palm. Now we're going to shake this all together, using plenty of ice. You have to make sure you shake this one very hard to get the ginger mixing through the drink. And now we're going to empty out this and then double strain into the martini glass. Now we're going to garnish this with a slice of ginger, which will give it a really nice aroma when we're drinking the actual drink and then put a couple of pomegranate seeds which will sink down to the bottom. So that is a palm and ginger martini. So this is what you're going to need for your palm and ginger martini. 50 mils of vodka, 1 nail of ginger, 12 and a half mils of lemon juice, 5 mils of palm syrup, 12 and a half mils of pressed apple juice, 25 mils of palm. You're going to muddle up your ginger with your palm syrup, then you're going to add your other ingredients, shake hard and double strain it into a chilled martini glass and garnish with a slice of ginger and some pomegranate seeds. This cocktail is perfect for a dinner party. Yeah.